Capital Safety Group is pleased to introduce the DBI Sala self-contained vacuum anchor system. Designed originally for the aviation market, the system can be used anywhere you need a ball arrest rated anchor point without drilling, welding, or altering the surface you are anchoring to. And the system is completely self-contained, meaning no external hoses are required. This feature makes the self-contained vacuum anchor system a portable and flexible solution for your ball arrest anchoring needs. The self-contained vacuum anchor can be used as a single anchorage point capable of supporting one person or used in conjunction with a secondary pad to create up to a 40-foot lifeline capable of supporting two people. This feature allows for greater flexibility when using the system on a large work surface such as an aircraft wing. The SCV-8 consists of two pads which pivot, allowing you to anchor onto a curved surface such as the fuselage of an aircraft. The pads are made of EPDM material, which is very resistant to wing de-icing fluids as well as Skydrol, a commonly used hydraulic fluid. The anchor pads are reinforced with aluminum plates. The channel connecting the two pads contains the Venturi vacuum, alarm system, and other components required to create the vacuum seal. These components are protected by a sturdy aluminum frame. The D-ring, where you will connect either the lanyard or the horizontal lifeline, is made of a zinc-plated forged steel alloy. When used with the DBI Sala Force 2 lanyard, the self-contained vacuum anchor is certified to meet OSHA requirements in the U.S. and CE standards in Europe. The self-contained vacuum anchor is approved for both fall restraint and fall arrest applications. Self-contained vacuum anchor primary pads with bottle attachment includes the housing and connection to use with the onboard bottle. This model gives the user the option of powering the unit with either the onboard bottle, shop air, or an external tank. The onboard bottle is purchased separately. The self-contained vacuum anchor secondary pad can be used to create a horizontal lifeline with either of the primary pad options. The self-contained vacuum anchor can be powered by an onboard bottle of compressed air or nitrogen, or by shop air. To use the system with the onboard bottle, begin by screwing it into the housing underneath the bottle guard until it's tight. Place the pad on a relatively smooth, non-porous surface and apply light pressure as shown. Depress the alarm bypass button and flip the red switch. At this point you'll notice the gauge climbing through the red into the green area, indicating a safe vacuum level has been achieved. The entire setup process will take about 30 seconds. Using the system with shop air is just as easy. Simply disconnect the hose leading from the bottle housing and connect the shop air source to the vacuum anchor. Follow the same setup procedure we discussed earlier and within a few seconds you'll have a fall arrest rated anchor point. For use in a horizontal lifeline application, you will need one primary pad, one secondary pad, a secondary pad hose and a lifeline, all of which are manufactured by Capital Safety. The secondary pad can be placed up to 40 feet away from the primary pad. Connect the secondary pad hose between the primary pad and the secondary pad. Follow the steps previously described to achieve a vacuum with the primary pad. Then flip the switch on the secondary pad and wait until the gauge reaches the green. The power source connected to the primary pad powers both the primary and secondary units. Now attach the lifeline to both the primary and secondary pads. Take the excess slack out of the line by ratcheting the tensioner at one end. And that's it! That's all there is to it. You now have a fall arrest rated horizontal lifeline system. To ensure the safety of the user, the self-contained vacuum anchor has a number of built-in safety features. 
If the source of compressed air or nitrogen becomes disconnected or stops, an alarm will sound. If the vacuum pressure falls below the safe level, the alarm will also sound. Even without the air source, the vacuum anchor remains sealed to the surface, allowing the user time to take the appropriate action. The self-contained vacuum anchor is very easy to maintain. Before each use, inspect the pads for any cuts or other wear. We recommend testing the alarm by flipping the red switch before any air source is connected. The alarm is powered by four AA batteries and can be easily changed by removing the battery pack on the side of the vacuum anchor. A more thorough inspection is required on an annual basis, or if the unit arrests a fall. This inspection can be completed by sending the vacuum anchor back to Capital Safety, or we can train your personnel to complete the inspection at your location. Thank you for your interest in our new self-contained vacuum anchor. Capital Safety Group is the world leader in fall protection equipment. Our sole focus is protecting workers from falls in a variety of industries. For more information about Capital Safety Group, please contact your local sales representative or visit us on the web at www.capitalsafety.com.